Hello and welcome back to another episode of Hogwarts Legacy. We are five hours in, going into episode eight, and I am still feeling a little under the weather, but that's not going to stop me from becoming the greatest wizard in all of Wizenden. Yes, uh, right, quests. What do we got to do? We got to go and meet the girl from the Wagadoo. Let's do this. Oh, actually, we could go to Herbology class and learn how to make potions. I think that's a good idea. We definitely need potions. Okay, right. Where well, we got to go, guys? We could uh, we could use the fires to get there, but it doesn't seem that far away. I hope it's just a twist and the turns of this place. There's so many places to go, so many places to see, and I think. If I haven't already by the time you've seen this, I think I'm going to stream some of the, uh, like, just the open worldness of this rather than the main missions because there's so much to explore and so much to do. I don't know if I've fit all of that into a Let's Play. I'll be playing it for the rest of my life, I think. So, uh, yeah, I might do a couple of streams on this, which probably by the time you've seen this, I've probably already done one, or maybe even two. Who knows? Have I got any... Uh... There was a ting... I don't see anything. Okay. Forget it then. Uh, why do I keep ending up at dead ends? Jeez. How's ah? Oh, oh, there's a door. Invisible door! That's very much visible. Hey guys! Me, newbie. Didn't do very well at fighting in the last episode. Gotta, gotta get better, gotta get stronger, faster. Harder. And decide whether or not we're going to be a good wizard or a bad wizard. Are we going to be the next Tom Riddle? Or are we going to be the next Harry Potter? I suppose the, the one before. This is set in the 1800s, by the way. It's a prequel. I didn't realise it was... Uh, yeah, I, I didn't know when it was set to, effectively. I knew it was a prequel, but I didn't know the date. So I checked it out, and it's apparently set in the late 1800s. I guess I know then. I won't go in there. I apologise for my bunged up sounding voice. And my sniffly nose in advance. I don't have a handy Good mute morning, button for Professor this Garlic. microphone. How it is to Professor Garlic, what a convenient you. name. Oh, You'll need these for today's class. Uh, um, uh, a little treat for your auntie. I'm already expert level 99 at potions. Just Please give me my, like, healing stuff. I'm amazing. We do look forward to growing together. Oh, that's nice. There's a lot of innuendo in this. It is to have everyone Either that or I've just got <laughs> dirty mind. This will be filled with enchantment and excitement, but the most important thing cultivated in herbology is knowledge. The prudent yep. herbologist is no more afraid of the venomous tentacular than the bouncing bone. Now then, today we will be acquainting ourselves with the mellifluous tuber known as the Mandrake Root. Oh, how handy. Akio. First year tasks again. Let's see if we can't make our fibrous friends a bit more comfortable, shall we? <laughs> First, let's protect our ears. Hmm. Is that why you got big, thick old hairdo covering your ears? Oh no, you're just going to put rocks in your ears, fair dues. Now, no problem. everyone... Grip the mandrake by the tendrils and give it a firm tug. Pull mandrake. Quickly, place your mandrake in the new core and cut down the soil. You, you might have been better off telling us uh, to uh, to do that before we. Pugged them out, uh, get, got them out of the first one. The soil should envelop the root like a warm, dirty blanket, putting the mandrake right at ease. I'll give you a warm, dirty blanket. Repair. I beg your pardon. I'm uh, handy. Really sorry about that. Yours was a bit mature, I'm afraid. All so right. I, I handled it with ease. I'm expert level 99. Work, All I had to do was press A and then R. Uh, 
It was amazing. I'm quite proud of myself, but I expect oh, this of myself because I'm the best wizard we'll in the whole wizarding world. At our potting tables. You can all get... Hmm. I wonder if hippogriffs like not grass. You can all get what? You can all get what? What? Yes, Professor. Firstly, well done with your mandrake. They can be rather difficult to get a grasp of. Not for me. I enjoyed it. I nearly went deaf. I enjoyed Actually, it. I enjoyed it. I couldn't help but catch your enthusiasm. Oh, here we go. Wink, wink. You can't go around like hitting on your teachers, bro. Soil. Now, as I mentioned, next we'll be planting. She just seemed quite young. Let us find you some seeds. Maybe it won't I be quite so bad. Some, Professor, pick them up in Hogsmeade. <laughs> you visited the magic neep. Wonderful. A prepared student is bound to bloom. I've arranged for you to have your own potting table here in the classroom. Wasn't oh, yeah. easy to spare one on such late notice. Plant but you did it for me. And you can return to harvest them later. You Being knew how good looking I was before I turned up, didn't you? And a bit of magic. They will take time to grow. Tom Holland is coming. I mean, Wibbly Wibble Wibblestone. This little arrangement. Niffler's fancy. Or Better get him a nice pot. Dittany's restorative properties make it a vital ingredient in the Wiganweld potion, as you all should know from Professor Sharp's class. Are you following me? Select the available seeds to begin planting. Once the seeds have been planted, the plant will take time to grow before being ready to harvest. Oh, really? I gotta do gardening? Oh, man. Dittany. That's the only one we can do, I guess. Uh, ten minutes! The leaves on this medical her... Ah, that, there we go. We can get the... Uh, Wigan Weld Potion. Okay. Is this one of those? If you pay us extra money, it will grow faster. Jobs. Nice. Well done. Thank you. Once it can be harvested, your destiny will be ready to use in Wigan Weld Potion. I'll let Professor Sharp tell you about that. Now, what say we branch out? Introduce you to a different sort of flora, the Chinese chomping cabbage. You'll find that some plants are better suited to uses outside of a cauldron. Oh, I get you. Wink, wink, nudge, nudge. Fortunately, I have a dummy for them to gnaw on. Be a dear really? and let them have a good chomping. Yes, Professor. They're in the other <laughs> greenhouse. It's just at the end of the footbridge leading... Is it the... just me? Your classmate... Let me know in the comments if it's just me. ...to accompany you. She dirty. You're finished. Oh, and mind your fingers. They do bite. Mm hmm. I bet they do. No, it's just me. I think it's because it's first thing in the morning. I'm not really paying attention. Okay, where are we going? I'm going to go get some Hello. chomping cabbages. I saw you Good on morning. your way to Hogsmeade the other day. Did you? Nice to meet you. What are you doing? I'm Leander. I'll be showing you the Chinese chomping cabbages. Up these stairs will take us there. But do you look at anywhere but at me, are you? Okay. Go to the other greenhouse. Nice I can work do this. Defense against the dark arts, by the way. I know. Excuse me. Your duel with Sebastian, and he's good. <laughs> Thinks he's really good. It's not that he good. Kept losing last night. It was brilliant. Oh, here we are, home of the Chinese chomp. Go on. Now, see that dummy? Just toss the cabbages at it. And they'll do the Hang rest. On. I'm collecting them all, mate. First. Okay, I've got a bunch of cabbages, so how do I toss them? What do I do to toss a cabbage? Hold LB and tap R to open the tool wheel and assign the Chinese chomping cabbages. Okay. We got a new wheel. Right. Then tap L to use your assigned tools. Look at that. Wow. They'll chomp on anything they can get their uh, mouths on. <laughs> Mum summoned her garden last year to keep the gnomes out. Did save her the denoming, but they left her honking daffodils in tatters. Can I pick it up again Fishes once I throw it? Aren't they? Oh, My jeez. Kind of plants. Not like stupid booba tubers and bouncing bulbs. The kind of plants that just have your back in Boob the Boob tubes? Uh, not so bouncing bulbs? Alone, but this game. Well, imagine that wasn't a dummy. And we had the B word in there. Yeah, that, I don't think this is a kid's game. Hmm, I suppose they could come in handy. Sure, but it's just a dummy. I was imagining it already. Oh, I don't know if I should just play this totally cocky. And just be like, yeah, I'm the best. Or if I should be nice. I suppose It'd they could nice. prove useful outside of the greenhouse. Nothing wrong with a bit of backup. 
even if it is from a cabbage. It's chaos yeah. out there. Trolls and hogsmead and such. You can't be above throwing a cruciferous vegetable if necessary. Dogweed and death cat has more of them, if you're keen. Other plants too. Ones your parents wouldn't plant in the garden. You get the idea. Anyway, we uh, probably ought to head back to class. Wow. Take your time. Okay. I'll see you back in I class. I'm going to take my time. I'll see you back in class. Can I, is there anything else I can steal from here? I could really do with, like, materials. Or making potions and whatnot. There was a... Yep, I can get the marshmallow leaves and the dittany leaves. This is very handy. I'm assuming my little uh, my thing I've planted is not going to be ready yet, which which sucks, bro. It sucks. I wonder if we can upgrade to have like multiple plant pots. I'm assuming that's going to be a thing. Can't get in there. It's locked, bro. It's got a lock on it. Got to go back and see P Professor Garlic. Work on this love interest we got. But before we do that, let's go. Oh, no. <laughs> let's not do that. Jeez. You... Do the quest or die. That helpful reminder as to why we should always wear our dragon hide gloves. I shall end our lesson here. I tended to the Chinese chomping cabbages, Professor. I mean, I stole them. Plants, aren't they? I hope they weren't too much trouble. Oh, don't see any bite marks or missing digits. I handled your cabbages <laughs> expertly, you my dear. Quite green fingered. Oh, I'm mm -hmm. eager to see your skill in the soil continue to blossom. My skill in the soil, eh? Mm hmm I see. I don't care much for plants, honestly. Magical plants. No, we gotta so be smooth, to bro. You wanna get in there with your teachers, more. you gotta say the Pathology right thing. Is a bounteous subject. Tend to your garden, and it will tend to you. Huh. Well, I suppose that's everything. Do come by for a chat sometime. I mm -hmm. so enjoy checking in with my new students. Checking out your new students, you mean? Jeez. Wow. I'm a little bit in love with my biology teacher, guys. He wants me to tend to a gar uh, tend to my garden. Steal the plants, steal the plants. Go everywhere and steal the plants. If you can't steal them, steal someone else's plants. Give me all the plants, bro. Me plant grown yet? Four minutes! Oh, jeez. Okay, well, I guess we can uh, explore this area for a few minutes while we wait for that to grow. And, um, yeah, see what's going on. Oh, a bit wet there. What she said? No, don't even go there, mate. Get it out of your mind. Okay. I wonder if she likes good student or a bad student I wonder if she'll like me more if I become more like Tom Riddle and evil and take over the world or if she'll like me more if I'm like Harry Potter well, Harry Potter was pretty useless to be fair let's be honest if he didn't have Hermione and Ron he would do he would done nothing he was totally useless on his own <laughs> he might have been like the the bestest wizard in the world apparently but he was he was honestly rubbish I'm going to be way better than him and Hermione and Ron put together. Give me all that money! I want to go find that chest that was in that bathroom, but I'm not sure which bathroom it was in. Last week, I performed a knee reversal hex on a second year. Good for you. You can even talk without moving your mouth. Impressive. Oh, that's a nice tree. It's a nice tree, isn't it? Off on another adventure, are we? I am, always. What I do, I'm adventure boy or adventure man. I'm, yeah, I'm a man now because I want to get in there with my teacher, so I better not be a boy. I'm 17, miss. I can, uh, I'm old enough. We won't get in trouble, honest. But the headmaster won't like it much, but uh, I wouldn't mind. This playthrough's not gone quite the way I expected it to. It's filth. It's pure filth, this game. Got naughty words in it. Naughty teachers. It's just, it's just a whole mess of dirt and filth. Hmm. Right, okay. I want to find exciting stuff. I don't want to wet a venture too far away from my uh, my growing plant because I want to go pick that up. Get some more potions if we can. Oh, that was a weird noise. What was that noise? Revelio. 
Got a ting. Can't go in there. It's locked. Level one lock. We need to figure out how we get through these level one locks. Secret door. Oh, deluxe house cloak. I'll take it. I'm so good at finding secrets, guys. It wasn't me. It was Tim. I really want to break these guys. They do my head in. Shut up. Incendio. Oops. It was Tim. I see him do it, miss. I could, it couldn't have been me, miss. I, me and you were together in the bedroom. I mean, uh, well, no, we were uh, doing herbology somewhere. Uh, decent. On me, miss. Oh, we're getting all the field guide pages. Dun, 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 dun. Oh, there's a Revelio. There's a Revelio. Take the thing for the bells. Three sisters' bells. I should probably read all of that stuff, but uh, I'm not going to. Indeed, your field guide. I'm most pleased to be included. What do you mean you're included? You're not included. Get out of it. My field guide. Get your hands off. Get your own field guide. That was something interactable. It's just shiny. Oh, we have new area. Okay. Oh, you said you were going to leave exploring to the live streams. Well, I'm just waiting for my plant to grow, mate. I got a few minutes. I thought I might as well come and explore while we're waiting for it to grow. You're right there, bud. Oh, hang on a minute. That's mine. Got him. We're at level nine. I want to get to level 99, and then I truly will be the greatest wizard in the whole world. I mean, I already am, let's be honest, but uh, numbers my numbers not my friend at the moment. I thought there might have been a back door into uh, the herbology department there, but it doesn't feel like there is. Take that though. Collecting all the things today. I'm glad we did herbology. I do have to say, I am enjoying this. I know I've moaned. <laughs> I've moaned a bit about the heavy dialogue when you're with somebody, and that is it. That's that's the same as me for every game. I don't know if it's just me, but when I'm playing a game, I want I just I want them to progress without them going on and on, and it just feels like there's so much in a lot of games. There's so much desire for them to over talk. Dear Madam Kogawa, marvelous news that you will be joining the faculty at Hogwarts as our new flying instructor. I dare say our work together at Hogwarts will be less eventful than a time near Yokohama Harbor. Though no one ever knows. I shall look forward to seeing you. If you have any questions in the meantime, please do not hesitate to send me an owl. Warm regards, Matilda Weasley. What am I writing Matilda Weasley stuff? Am I nicking the headmistresses or deputy headmistresses bits and bobs? Oh, hello. It wasn't me. It was Tim. I see him do it. Oh, what are you new flame thing. Now? Nothing. Is it the flame things that's talking to me? It must be. Go see Hagrid's shack. But where's Hagrid, huh? Where's Hagrid? Anything I can uh, steal from here? I mean, not steal. It's it's just borrowing. <laughs> Excuse me. I'm perfectly well, guys. Oh, there's a chap. Good morning. I see you're tending to this invisible beast here. Good job. Make sure it doesn't run away, please. Can't even go in there. Oh, man. We need to level up stat. We need to figure out those door locks. So we figured out, the obviously, the, the arithmetic or whatever it were, were ones. But the ones with the locks, I'm assuming we're going to get a... An enchantment that bust locks. A lock pick enchantment or something like that. 
Or maybe there's a particular plant we can grow that will do it. I've always said that travel broadens the mind. Yep, me too. Rebellion. That's what I've always said. The secret door down there. Maybe it's not a secret one, but it was a door. Ooh, what's going on in here? Someone's been letting off the stink bombs. What's well, Tim? Ah, hang on a minute. Need to switch out my... Uh... No, wrong one. Oh, jeez. I wanted it on that one. What goes at the bottom? Oh, the flame one, which I never use. Uh, maybe we'll just have that on there for now, because we don't Lumos. use the flame one. And find that picture. Half man, half horse. What could it mean? What could it mean? What could it mean? If you don't know what that is, that's a GLC reference. Somebody let me copy their potions homework. I find the firefly thing. I got him. Come on, guys. Come with me. I put you back on your picture, bro. Get special powers. Yeah. You did it. Ooh. What's Tim? I see him. I honestly, it was. I know it did. Oh, hang on a minute. Sneaky, sneaky time. You can see me, bro. Look at your stuff. You didn't even know about it. You suck. What's Tim? Right, I need to go back to Herbology now. And I kind of don't know the way anymore. I've got a bit lost. Let's have a look at the uh, the old map. Cam, show me the map. There was a flu network thing right near it, so it's going to be down here somewhere. Uh, what's that one? Library Annex. No, we don't want the library. We want uh, Herbology. Or maybe it's part of the Library Annex. That's the one we want. Greenhouses. Take me there. Plant must have grown by now. Imagine how inconvenient travel was before I invented flu powder. Mm hmm. Flu powder, you say? It's ready! My Disney leaves! There's gonna be another 10 minutes. Oh man. So, can I craft things then? Is there. Now that I've got these ingredients, if I go into my inventory, can I craft potions? What's this? Oh, that's that letter. I got a bunch of them. Surely I can use them to do something with. No? Hmm. I mean, I'm assuming that's what it's all about, is for crafting. I mean, what's the point in giving you ingredients if you're not going to craft them? Oh man, that takes us up even higher. The Lux House Cloak. I'll take it. Oh, and it's rather fancy. Yeah, we'll keep the look of that one as well. Okay, what about our outfit? We got a new one as well. Those as well we've got. Well, that's taking our defense up quite a lot as well. And that one. So that's defense 16. This one's 17. It's even better. It's a superb Tatashul vest. New York school uniform. Let's wear it. Oh man, look at our stats now. We are getting there, guys. All these secret areas. See, I was say if I did a like a whole once I've unlocked more areas of the world. If I was to uh, upgrade, just me and you here, teach, saying, just me and you. Um, yeah. If if we was to, oh, is this crafting bench? No. Dear Professor Garlic, stop interfering with the students, you dirty little minx. Didn't say that really. How very thoughtful of you, and remember that strawberries are my favourite. They're as sweet as can be, and it's no wonder muggles love them so much. Everything you cultivate seems to be of such high quality. Someone else trying to get in there with uh, Professor Garlic. Everything you cultivate seems to have such high quality. From bitter root to berries, I do hope that my darling niece can learn this skill whilst under your tutelage. Lenora so adores you, as to all of your students, I'm sure. Warmest regards, Eleanor Everly. Oh man, everybody, everybody wants a piece of Mrs. Garlic. Yeah, so anyway, as I was saying, if we was to unlock a few more areas, now that we've got access to that huge world map, we could potentially just 
there were a couple of streams just going off and gathering all of the secret bits and uh, just really leveling up and then using that to our advantage for the quest lines. And I How think that nice would probably be a good idea. Friend. Shut up, I'm talking. Jay. A rude. Rebellion. Right, okay. So what is the next thing for our quest? Where do we need to go next? What do we need to do? Let's have a look. Check out our quest. We need to go and uh, meet what's the face in the garden, but I kind of want to save that till the next episode. Oh, there is more potion class to do. Next class, I must have tested potions. Okay, well, let's do that then. Was I not just there? Oh, no, I did herbology. Potions is different. So I, now I've done herbology. Now that I can go to potions and... Um, Where are you taking me? Yeah, I can go to potions and turn my herbs into potions. That makes sense. Wouldn't there be auras or someone from the ministry guarding the school after the incident in Hogsmeade? There we go. What teacher we got here then? Wait. I have to wait till the next day. God, that kid's been here all night. Begin. Potions is one of the most challenging and hazardous subjects taught at this school. As fifth years, you will be required to reach new heights of both discipline and intellect. You will begin this term by brewing a Wigan Weld Potion. Mr. Takar, can you tell us why this particular potion might come in handy? Yes, Professor Sharp. The Wigan Weld Potion can be used to sterilize and even heal a variety of injuries. It can heal some injuries, but not all. Points for Ravenclaw. He looks Before drunk. Today's class is completed. Is drunk? Each of you will have brewed a Wigan Weld potion of your own. See, that always got really bad back. You never know when you might need it. Please begin. No problem, Buzz. I'm gonna brew the bestest wig and well potion you ever seen, Buzz. Get my pestle and mortar. Use a strong, even motion when crushing your ingredients. No problem, Buzz. Please very strong. be meticulous when adding powder to your potions. One errant sneeze could be disastrous. But no good for me while well, I've got a cold then. What? Oh, bit of hot drink juice, a, bit, a little bit more. Yes. Put in my giant spoon. There, the cauldron. If only Professor Garnet could see me now, she would be, oh, be over the moon with how well I stirred my cauldron. I see most of you have not forgotten how to stir. Not me, sir. I'm really good at stirring all sorts of problems, mm. you know, things. Not an easy potion to brew. Well done. Thank you. And from what I hear of your recent exploits in Hogsmeade, you'd also do well to practice brewing the defensive Edurus potion. Okay. Professor Weasley had you acquire the recipe from Jay Pippins, correct? Yes, sir. Good. For the moment, you can find the ingredients you need in my office. But in the future, you'll be expected to provide your own ingredients. My own ingredients? Some can be harvested from the plants you grow in your student, bro. Class, and rarer ones can be purchased. Others, however, may be harder to obtain and will require you to be a bit more resourceful. Resource gathering stream. And we'll see if it was skill or luck the first time around. Okay. It's quite clearly skill, sir. Quite, quite clearly My skill. Considered keeping me home from school this year after Don't care about Did your parents, bro. Sharp say that you have permission to go into his office? That's right. He did say that. He wants me to get more ingredients to brew another potion. Brilliant! You, my friend, have been presented with an extraordinary opportunity. You remember me, don't you? Gareth yeah. Weasley. Ah, Gareth yes. Weasley. I remember we you. We met in the common room. Listen, anyone with a troll-sized brain can brew an Adurus potion. I'm working on something that's certain to be spectacular. I'm just missing Secret one tiny bro. last ingredient that will add that extra spark. I suspect that's where I come in. You're as clever as I'd hoped. I simply need a single Fupa feather. As you'll already Fruit be in Sharp's office with his permission, perhaps you could grab it for me. I bet Mrs. Garlic likes a Fuper feather. I'll get you the Fuper feather, as long as you're certain Sharp won't miss it. I assure you he won't. 
Fruit feathers aren't that valuable. Wait mm. until you see what I'm brewing. Hurry back to me when you have the feather. Won't it? No problem, bro. I get the feather for you. A well prepared with Don't go for Dog skin, basically. Swinder eggs, yep, okay. Super feather. Get one of those. Any more ingredients for me to collect? Chest, steal his money. Oh, he got his school uniform. Stole your cloak, sir. Good job, I got my special stealing gloves on. Precision is key when brewing potion. Here's the whopper feather you wanted. Brilliant! Thank you. Just shout it out take a in, to brew. in front of everyone. You, get back to brewing your you guys have never and done passing notes at school, have you? Finished. Not how you do passing notes, guys. Proficiency and potions are two things that cannot be rushed. Have patience and be thorough. No problem, bro. I got this. How hard could it be? 28! Oh, 28 seconds. Oh, that's 28 minutes. I gotta wait. And now we add the mallow sweet. And that's odd. What's happening? What have you done? Wait, oh, Gareth. To... Ah. Oh, Gareth. What happened? <laughs> well done, Gareth. Good job. You still owe me. What now, Mr. Weasley? There we go. Sorry, Professor. Let's make some more of these. That'll be points from Gryffindor. I can't make Again. more of those. I need more hawk lump Mr. juice. Weasley okay. Did not do this on his can I make some more of that? No, I can't. His accomplice will answer to me as well. I made the potion, bro. I brewed an Adurus potion as you asked, Professor. I'm surprised you had the time. You seemed rather busy helping Mr. Weasley brew chaos. Uh... I'm sorry, Professor. I was merely trying to help a friend. Taking responsibility for one's actions does go a long way with me. I shall assume that you've learned a lesson. As for the I work you my today in your own cauldron, I will say you've done well. I confess I was... Skeptical, given the advanced nature of this class and the fact you're a new student. I'm glad I was able to meet your expectations. A rare occurrence. And you do well to remember that you're not a potions master quite yet. In addition to having a solid grasp of how to combine various ingredients, you should gain an understanding of the ingredients themselves. Yes. Pay particular attention in herbology. The plants you nurture there are often essential to the potions you brew here. Now, I recommend that you find a safe location in which to practice brewing. You cannot leave a hot cauldron simply anywhere. That'll be all. Do we need somewhere to put up a cauldron? Jeez, okay. I think each of us has had enough excitement for one day. Right, okay, so that quest, is that over? No, not over. There, now it's over. Jeez. Okay. So, with the quest being over, that means we are now open to go back to our other quest. However, we're not going to do that today. What we are going to do is we're going to have a look through all of the things that we've been doing, see if we've unlocked any new stuff, uh, and see if we got any new goodies. I guess not. I think you need to get all of those things to get the, the rewards for those. What about this one? Field pages. We've been doing a lot of field pages. Claim rewards. Yeah, we can claim reward on that one. I guess not on everything. It's hard that some things you can and some things you can't. Okay, what about collections? Do we get rewards for these things or is this just showing us what we've done? Yeah, this, this is basically the Pokedex, isn't it? This is like, oh, look at all of the things that you've, you've learned and gathered. Okay. That's fine. Well, I'm not too fussed about that then. In that case, have we got any new gear? We do. We got another new outfit. Is it even better? It's exactly the same. We've got the same level of defense. It's well appointed, whereas this one's superb. That one's worth 90. This one's worth 60. So, yeah, we're going to keep the one we've got on. We can always sell our uh, professors. <laughs> Selling stuff. <laughs> the, the, the glasses, though. Wow, they are a, a step up. Going uh, all the way up to 19 there, so we shall don these glasses. They're quite snazzy, however, I am going to uh, change the appearance because I don't want them. Thank you very much. Okay, right, that is it for today's episode. I hope you enjoyed it. If you do, if you are enjoying these, don't forget to subscribe if you're not already and hit that like button. 
and I'll see you all in the next one.